talking about. Loud. She's talking about what he doing. And what he doing is mm. ignorant. That's y'all problem. What's the problem? You sit here creating all these broken homes. I don't understand why men feel listen, like marriage. This is my thing. Okay, listen, go ahead. I don't understand why men feel like marriage is a greater commitment than having children. You can divorce somebody and never speak to them again, bust that shit down, never have to pay nothing or whatever, and say your goodbyes. It's just a fucking breakup. Niggas do that all day long. But when you have a kid, you are responsible. Whether you do it or, or choose to lean into that responsibility or not, you are responsible for that life and that connection and that bond with that person for the rest of everybody's life. It, it's like a game. One of y'all got to die out. Like, either the kid or the baby mama. But until, as long as all three parties are alive, y'all connected. Whether you choose to stay connected or not. It's a kid that's somewhere that's like, and if you don't choose to stay connected, then you even more of a bitch-ass nigga. You shouldn't have been laying down anyway. Because why you having kids that you're not going to take care of? I think the system that's is my rigged. Skill. The system is rigged. What you got to <clears throat> um, First of all, can we let some of these people that these men are having babies with Go interview them and see if they got a problem with what's going on. You don't know what kind of father this man is behind them cameras. Just because a woman get on there and try to tell a nigga about himself, that's the problem. You need to talk to these women about these women. Let the niggas talk to the niggas about the niggas because at the end of the day, Cam Newton got enough money to take care of all his kids, his fucking self, and the motherfucking woman that's interviewing him. What are you talking about? I Listen, the marriage is way more detrimental because they got more to lose in the end. At the end of the day, if you lose that child and the baby mama, you still can have a good relationship with that child. Once that marriage shit go down the drain, you out of money, you out of, you got to go to court, all this extra shit, and y'all never get the ass end of the stick. So if you want to take your time, my nigga, and wait to find the right one that you feel like ain't going to, you know, do some bullshit later on down the line, take your time. The Bible say be fruitful. Nigga be, the nigga being fruitful. Doing what the fuck God told him to do. The Bible also <clears throat> says to be committed to get... one. A man who finds a wife finds a good thing. Listen, Second of all, listen. money. Wait, money. You lose. You, you, my you are out of money. <laughs> you, <some> money. <laughs> you are also out of money. <laughs> you are also out of money when a child becomes involved. And just because you can afford to take care of these women, you're talking about the stability, the, the sustainability of the relationship with those women. How you're not thinking about Cam, the how children. How often do Cam Newton see his kids? It don't matter how often. No, 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 no. Just ask the question. How often do you see His other baby mama ever came know. out. Y'all know. I'm going to tell you. His <laughs> other baby mother came out and said that they do one week on, one week off, which is very admirable for Bro, somebody. You, you can look up at niggas who do, let's say niggas who do stand up who on the road all um, two, three weeks at a time. What's the difference? Y'all don't even know. I, my dad was in the house. I still ain't see that nigga. He works so much. <laughs> <laughs> like, bro, like, what the fuck? Like, it's too much opinionated shit going on with niggas who handle their business because you got a lot of niggas who got a lot of kids that don't do shit. You right. Now, you got a nigga that doing something and you sitting up here tearing them down? It's with not, no ring, like you got some shit to talk. You ain't got shit to talk about. It's not about tearing them down. It's about restoring the you black community he, and household. And I think that's no, all no, no, we're working he, if he, As long as we keep making kids, we keep restoring the black community. All right. Well, keep going. We just gonna have a difference of opinion. Longest, um, longest. Speaking, you know who else would agree? Longest Cam ain't no gay bitch. <laughs> <laughs> the community go. Long as niggas ain't gay bitches, we gonna keep goddamn. We gonna keep it going.